the Spirit of God turns a man into another man. The Spirit of God is an enabler. The Spirit of God energizes a man. The Spirit of God helps a man to do what he ordinarily would not do. When that Spirit of the Lord came upon Saul, he was able to prophesy. And they began to say, is Saul also among the prophets? So in the territory that you and I want to take this year, you need the Spirit of the Living God to come inside of you. The Spirit of the Living God is the power of God for you to do what you want to do. For you to carry out the assignment that God has given to you. The Spirit of the Lord will help you to manifest His glory. The Spirit of the Lord will help you to achieve great and mighty things. The Spirit of the Living God will help you to move from one level of life to another. It will help you to conquer territories. So when the Spirit of the Lord came upon Saul, he began to prophesy before he wasn't a prophet. And he began to have here saying that he saw also among the prophets. The enablement was given upon him. The empowerment was given unto him. What he could not do before, he began to do it. In this season, you and I are taking territory. We are entering offices that we never entered before. Amen. We are entering two levels of manifestation that we never entered before. Amen. Experiences that we never had in our life, but we begin to have it. Amen. Places that were close off for us, we didn't have access to it before. Now we begin to have access to it. Amen. Men and women of high repute, men and women that matter that we never have relationship with as we go on in this season, God will begin to position us around them. Amen. We begin to have access to them, we begin to meet with them, we begin to fellowship with them. Amen. Whatever it is that we need that they is in their hand, they begin to give it all to us. Amen.